morning and good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to VCLS webinar, Understand the Main CMC Challenges to Improve ATMP Development. I am Valerie Pompano, Vice President of CMC and Quality at VCLS, and I am glad to moderate today's webinar. I am with my colleague, Alexandra bummer who is director in the CMC group and based in the US and with François Gianelli, Associate Director within the group as well and based in Europe. Both have been involved in several ATMP projects covering clinical development and registration and will share with us EU and US perspective on the topic of CMC challenges. So today we will touch briefly on definitions and regulatory framework followed by a presentation on of on uh, what we consider to be the main ch CMC challenges and how to integrate them as part of development. We will finish by a few take-home messages and have a Q&A session to address questions you may raise during the presentation. I will now leave the stage to uh, Alex in order to cover the definitions from EU and US perspective. Thank you, Valerie. Uh, good morning and good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for taking the time to attend this webinar. It's our pleasure to share our experience with you on this field. For this audience, we will not spend too much time on definitions, however, to ensure that everyone is on the same page. And I saw that from the poll, about 50% have a um, basic knowledge on ATMPs. We'll give a brief overview on the definitions. In Europe, this therapeutic class is named ATMP, which stands for advanced therapy medicinal product. It involves four types, gene therapy medicinal product, somatic cell therapy, tissue engineered, and combined ATMP. In the US, the term used is CGT and refers to cellular and gene therapy. Now that we're on the same page regarding the definitions, we'll start presenting the CMC challenge. For those that have worked with small molecules or even with more traditional biologicals, CMC is rarely on critical path for development. With cell and gene therapy, things are a little different. We're often in an accelerated development where there is a, a result from a clinical perspective and then CMC on the critical path. We know the product works, now the question is, can we make it? So my colleague Francois will be presenting our first CMC challenge today. Thanks, Alex, and welcome everyone. Um, so the first issue we wanted to discuss today is, 